Hey everyone, this is Paul from OrthoEvalPal. I want to do a uh, kind of a modified evaluation on Jake's knee here. Jake is 21 years old and how long has your knee been bothering you? About a year. Okay, and when does it bother you the most? When I'm running. Okay, and put a finger on where it bothers you the most. Right there. Okay, and it's pretty specific to that area, right? Yeah. Okay, and are you getting any snapping, cracking, or popping when you're running? Uh, it pops over the kneecap. Okay, so you get some discomfort like and popping sensation in that area right there. Does it ever swell? Uh, it feels like it does. Okay, um, and um, how about your regular exercise routine or during the day when you're, when you're just working? Uh, any problems with it then? Not much walking at the gym sometimes. Okay, so when you're doing some leg strengthening activities. Yeah. Okay, any problems when you're squatting? Uh, Rarely, but sometimes. Okay. What's worse, squatting or doing a knee extension machine like this? Uh, leg extensions. Leg extensions, okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put him on the table. We'll do a brief evaluation. I'll walk you through this. We'll see if we can figure out where he's getting this pain and um, this popping sensation. And uh, we'll talk about that and go from there. So I'm going to have you lie right down on your back if you could. Jake is pretty strong, so he does a lot of leg work and he, and he does well with that. Uh, so he has, I'd like you to tighten up your muscle. So he's got great tone in his quad. I want you to relax now. I'm gonna do a brush test to see if there's any swelling inside his knee. And there isn't there, okay? I'm gonna take a look at his kneecap mobility. And that is really good, okay? Now um, I'm gonna palpate his patella tendon. Any pain there? Nope. No problem there, we're gonna bend the knee. And I'm going to palpate the medial joint line. Any problems there? Nope. Okay, how about on the outside? Lateral joint line. So I'm thinking in my head, medial joint line, medial meniscus, structures in that area. Um, lateral joint line, lateral meniscus, and those structures in that area. Um, we have full motion. No problem there. Nope. We can go all the way out this way. No problem there when I push you into hyperextension. Okay, let's check your ACL. I want you to relax your leg. Okay, just totally let it go. Excellent endpoint. We're gonna do his medial capsule with a valgus stress test. We're gonna do the medial collateral ligament again with some valgus, no problems there. Okay, and we're gonna do lateral capsule. Any problems there? And if we do the lateral collateral, with a very stress, no problem there. Nope. Okay. Now, I'm going to just check out your meniscus. So, any problems when I do that? Nope. Okay. How about when I do this? Uh, just hip tightness. But okay, yeah. And he is a little bit tight on the hip, but not terrible. Okay. All right. So, I'm going to just poke around the outer side of your kneecap. Any problems there? Nope. Okay. And then the bottom side. What about in here? Nope. Now typically this is where we would see a medial retinacular plica. Right there, it's a little piece of, you know, like an al dente piece of spaghetti. Is that painful? Nope. Okay, but now I'm gonna get up here and I want you to take a look at this. Right there. You can even hear it. Is that where you have your pain? Yeah. So what happens is he's having this piece of plica here that is rubbing over his patella when he runs. And sometimes, and I'll have we pull back the camera up just a little bit, sometimes you can see that. I don't know if we can right there. Right there. You can see where it pops over. Right. You can't get it every time, but oftentimes we can get that just to pop right over. And you can see it right here. So that's a piece of plica, a real big band that is in that area. Now, as far as um, what we can do about that in therapy, we've tried a little bit of taping. We've tried um, some quad strengthening, some flexibility. That is structural. That is not going to go away. Uh, so we're going to try some bracing to see if we can kind of hold it in a better position when he's running. Other than that, this is a surgical situation where they would have to um, resect that plica, take it out, and uh, just 
stop it from rolling over that patella. So structurally he looks good. All ligaments look great. The posterior side of his knee looks good. He has no issues here. We've been working on, on a lot of gastroxoleus flexibility with him and overall hip strengthening um, because he's had uh, compartment releases and he's responded really well from that. But his most limiting factor is this pain that he has the medial side of his kneecap on the inside here. Um, and uh, that is a plica, which I think at some point, if he's gonna continue running, we'll probably have to have that surgically fixed. Um, hope you like today's video. If you did, give us a thumbs up, be sure to subscribe. And if you have any questions or comments, leave those in the comment section below and uh, be more than happy to get back to you. Thanks.